the building in flames, others in ruin. Signs that the front line in Ukraine's east is inching closer to the town of Lysychansk. People living here have grown used to the sound of shells exploding. They say nowhere is safe. There was an explosion, then the house began to shake, and the scaffolding fell to the ground. We didn't even have time to understand what was happening. The falls on both sides will have to come to an agreement sooner or later, because it's always the innocent people who suffer. Yet the worst could still be to come here. Only a river separates Lysychansk from Severodonetsk, a city that's become the epicenter of Russian efforts to capture the eastern Donbass region. Intense street-to-street -street fighting has devastated what's become the last pocket of Ukrainian resistance in Luhansk. The mayor says power and communications have been cut off. Further from the front line in the city of Bakhmut, the war is creeping closer. Some here even accuse President Zelensky of abandoning the East. He forgot about Donbas. He only cares about his Kyiv. He forgot about the Donetsk and Luhansk regions. Others have already left on special evacuation trains organized by Ukrainian authorities. As the Russian assault grinds on, they had no other choice but to flee west.